Okay, so the question is, why can't I hypnotize someone to make them forget their name like I once demonstrated? Well, first of all, the word can't. Let go of the word can't. You can do it. Um, and also, it really depends on the situation. Um, uh, apparently, there was a demonstration that they saw, uh, probably a street hypnosis demonstration that I did, where I hypnotized someone, had them forget their name, and they're wondering why they're unable to replicate that. Well, it really has to do with a lot of uh, factors. First of all, I don't always... Uh, bad a thousand. You know, when we go out there on the street and we're filming me doing things uh, uh, for that sort of thing, uh, you know, what we're, what we're not putting uh, on any kind of channel is where it doesn't quite work out. You know, it doesn't always work out. That's not very interesting, so we usually don't share that. Uh, so realize that, you know, everyone strikes out. It has to do with the person. Some, some people just aren't that suggestible. Uh, it has to do with the, the moment. You know, maybe they're overly caffeinated. Um, you know, I've been on doing street hypnosis at times for, you know, demonstration purposes to show the power of hypnosis. And, uh, you know, people were drunk. It was Vegas, but, you know, it, doesn't work under those situations very well either. So it really depends on a lot of things. Realize that when you're hypnotizing someone to get them to forget their name, the standard's pretty high. You know, that's their name. You want them to forget. When someone does a stage hypnosis show, they will have people on the stage who are very suggestible. And you have to be very, very suggestible in order to forget your name. It's your name you've had all your life. So stage hypnotist has it easy. They have a lot of people to choose from. Everyone wants to be on stage. They bring them up. The ones who aren't suggestible, who aren't following orders, uh, and, uh, and we're not sh showing that they're suggestible in other ways, are asked to leave the stage. The ones who are suggestible and do what you say are left on the stage, and those are the ones who are going to do things like that. They're going to be able to forget their names because they have what I call a high hypnotic aptitude. They're very easy to uh, put into hypnosis because they're very suggestible. So those are the people that you want. Um, and, you know, if you're just doing a rant, uh, hypnotizing a random person, they may or may not be one of those people.